What up YouTube, Sibo here and welcome back to another video. If you're new around here, hello, welcome to my channel. It has been an absolute ridiculous amount of time since I uploaded the last video, going on six months actually, and in my absence, my channel has just grown. There is now over 600 of you guys, which is insane, given that I haven't made a video in six months, so I absolutely really appreciate you guys continuing to watch my channel and subscribing. Welcome, new videos to come, and I'm looking forward to getting to know and you guys. Today's video is going to be a Tommy Hilfiger haul video. I've never made a haul video before, largely because I don't do a whole lot of shopping at once and buy like a whole wardrobe at any one given time. But on my recent trip to Florida over Black Friday, I bought an insane amount of Tommy Hilfiger items. Mostly t-shirts, largely because I do work and live in a hot climate most of the year. And so I generally dress in t-shirts and shorts. There's a couple of pairs of jeans in there and a few jackets. But um, yeah, let's get started. Okay, so I'm going to bring the clothes over in bunches just because I have so much to get through. Starting off with one of the long sleeve Tommy Hilfiger t-shirts I picked up. Uh, we have this beautiful one here in a navy color with the red and white stripe going down the sides. Now I don't usually wear long sleeves. I did pick up a couple and I've actually taken to these really well. These are some of my favorites from what I bought and I also have this t-shirt in the white colorway as well with the stripes down the side. So. I also have another one I picked up in white. This one has the pattern, the logo down the front and a nice little fluffy pattern just added there. This one is pretty minimalistic. This one is the most basic t-shirt I've bought from all the Tommy Hilfiger stuff I've bought. But it's a nice soft material with the logo across the front. And I think this is one I would generally wear at home if I want to be comfortable like in like a pajama sort of thing. So this one's really, really nice. I also got a few of these ones, again with the logo across the front, but this one has got like that soft leather like plasticky sort of feel across the front of it, which is quite restricting when you wear it across the chest. I got this in a black and I also got it in a white as well. I'll show you the white one. And I got a gray t-shirt. Largely most of the t-shirts I bought are white, blue, some black, but I generally, and gray, those are the sort of colors that I stick to with what I like to wear. This one is also one of my favorites. This is just a nice gray number. Again, nice soft material with the embellished logo. Here I have a couple that are folded up because these have just been washed, hang on. Oh, this one is also one of my favorites. Another white t-shirt with a blue rounded collar. And this one has the logo across the front. Out of all the t-shirts I bought that are short sleeve, these ones are my favorite. I do like this pattern. This one is the one with the sort of like denim feel pattern across the front that is restricting when you wear it. But again, it looks nice across the chest. So we have that as well. <laughs> Quite a lot. Okay, on to the next pile. We do have a couple of polos. I like to dress up very, very rarely. And when I do, I would rather plunk for a polo than an actual shirt because I'm not a fan of the buttons and how restricting they are. I decided to get these nice polos in three different colorways. So this is the blue one here. We also have a white one with the nice stripes across the collar and on the sleeves. And I have it in gray. So again, most of the t-shirts I wear are gray, white, and blue. They're the three colorways I generally stick to, and it goes with a lot of the stuff I buy. So I decided to get them in all three. This one you've already seen in the white colorway. Why are you buying the same t-shirt in different colorways? Basically, uh, these were very cheap. Okay, I'm gonna get to the price at the end, but I did pay a really good price for all the Tommy Hilfiger stuff I bought. So I got this one in the navy as well. Again, this one is my favorite pattern that goes across the top. These fit really, really well. These are all large, because I'm a larger guy, um, but I really like the cut on all of these t-shirts. This one is a little bit different. More like a basketball jersey type t-shirt. I haven't really wore this one yet, to be honest. It's a little bit out there, and the Hilfiger logo across the front is a reflective sort of like blue color. This one I kind of wish I didn't buy. It's one of the most basic ones out of the bunch, but I really just, I guess I don't like the material of it and the fluffy Hilfiger across the front in the white. I'm not really feeling that, so I haven't really wore this one yet. Again, I did go ahead and buy a couple of pairs of jeans. I am more of a trackies, Adidas, long-term wearer. That's pretty much what I wear all the time, but sometimes I do like to wear in denim. Uh, so this was the first pair I picked up, Tommy Hilfiger jeans with the lovely stripe that runs right down the side of the pants, and they are cropped at the bottom. 
nice and elasticated so they fit me well and these are just my go-to when I want to wear a pair of jeans these are big by the way <laughs> I'm a big guy but yeah these are really really nice and I really really like this pattern I did pick up another pair of jeans in a light blue wash I am a light blue kind of jeans kind of guy but I haven't really worn these ones yet and um, they are elasticated but they don't fit me really well they're a bit tight they have the logo here across the pocket and also on the butt on the there's a tiny little one here and also they are nice and cropped to the bottom as well I like them to be either elasticated or nice and thin at the bottom because I like to show off my footwear you will not catch me wearing jeans that don't have this sort of elasticity if you're feeling a little bit double denim I went and bought a denim jacket as well to go along with it now I really really like this denim jacket when I seen it in the shop I was gagged I was like I need to buy that straight away because what look at the collar how sick is this this of course is the reverse so this sits behind but if you want to prop it up which I haven't you know it kind of stays hidden it is underneath there on the back of the jacket we do have really really nice logo here Tommy Hilfiger denim with the detailing across the front as well this is super swaggy and I paid an insane price for this and all the other stuff that I bought so really really happy really really like this fit with the buttons as well on the front there is a nice red detailing underneath all the buttons because it is of course Tommy Hilfiger and it's one of the prime colors so yeah the blue and red it does pop on this jacket it's really really nice moving on to zippers I did buy this nice uh, full zip jacket with the red and white across the front. This one goes really, really nice with the jeans. Again, probably not gonna wear this that much. Well, I'm, when I'm at home, I'll wear it, but when I work overseas, I generally don't get to wear these things because they are too warm, so it probably won't be going with me, but that one's really nice. And I have this one, which is a little bit thinner. It's a nice soft material. It's an over the head with a pull down zip at the front with the detailing with Hilfiger written there. And it is the nice blue, red and white statement Hilfiger colors. On the arm here, we've got the logo. And on the back of the hood, we have the logo running down with a strip. So there you go guys, you've seen all the Tommy Hilfiger items that I picked up in the sale. I'm now gonna tell you exactly what I paid for all that I got. Okay guys, I've just checked my online bank statement and I can confirm that I spent 474 pounds total in the Tommy Hilfiger store. 474 pounds divided by 24 items is 19 pound 75 pence per item that I got from the Tommy Hilfiger store. So now you can see why I bought so much. Absolutely insane deal. I got a really, really good price and I cannot wait to wear all this stuff. That is pretty much it for this video, guys. Thank you very much for joining me. If you did enjoy, remember to smash that like button and subscribe if you're new to my channel and you wanna see more of my disgusting face. Thank you very much for joining me, guys, and I shall see you in the next one. Bye-bye.